Well, the other very strange uh, thing about being in uh, Fort Mac was uh, culturally, uh, their approach to uh, drinking and driving is more, uh, go for it! Uh, <laughs> Which is jarring, right? Because like, well, here in British Columbia, we have some of the uh, strictest drinking and driving laws uh, on the planet, right? For the most part, that's something I, I support. Uh, some people say they're too strict, but it's tough to have like an open debate about it, right? Because the laws are supported by a group called Mothers Against Drunk Driving, which is literally, it's a group of people's moms who don't like drunk driving, because so nobody wants to go against them. Nobody, they might as well be the Coalition of Puppies for Hugs. They are, <laughs> that is an invincible. <laughs> and the thing is, every other conflict in our society is at least like nominally two-sided, right? Like wherever you stand on it, it's like, well, well, this group of people, we really love baby seals. Well, this group of people, we're really worried about the economic vitality of Inuit communities. <laughs> Guys, I'm gonna have to Google this. <laughs> That's like an actual adult dilemma. Not so moms versus drunks. That's <laughs> no one's still nobody's still on the fence about uh but I think it'd be a fair fight. I think you have to at least be able to conceive of someone hosting a debate between the two sides. And no one's ever gonna, because it would be ludicrous to have those. Touch in this corner. They gave us life. <laughs> and they nursed us with the best move. A physical manifestation of their love for us, which was unconditional. <laughs> Mothers! <laughs> and over in this corner, ooh, they sure had a lot of rum and cokes. <laughs> Didn't really feel like calling a cab. <laughs> we we'll bring the mothers out for the opening statement. She would just do... We just love you so much. <laughs> Drunks, do you have a rebuttal? Yeah, fucking. <laughs> <laughs> Bud Light Lime is the juice, basically. <laughs> Yeah.